So here's a mistake that I see riders make frequently. When you're learning to ride, you pull the clutch all the way in, you shift the bike into first gear, and you start out. Now pulling up to a stoplight or a stop sign, I'm usually going to pull the clutch all the way in because I'm coming to a stop. It's just easier to hold it in this position than out. But generally, once I start riding, I leave the stop stoplight, release the clutch through the friction zone, get ready to shift into second gear. I'm not bringing the clutch all the way back in to shift to second gear. I'm going to reach for that clutch. I'm going to pull it just enough so that those clutch plates separate. I'm shifting into second gear. I'm releasing the clutch. Third gear, same thing. Bring that clutch in far enough to get those clutch plates to separate, shift into gear, release the clutch back out. It wastes a whole lot of motion bringing that clutch all the way in. Plus you've got all of this room here that's wasted space. It makes it harder to find that friction zone. That's making your shift less smooth because you're releasing the clutch back out, trying to find that friction zone. If you bring it right past the friction zone or just into the friction zone, you'll find that your bike shifts nice and smooth and you're right there ready to release the clutch back out and get back out on the road. Same thing doing slow speed maneuvers. I'm not squeezing the clutch all the way in. I'm playing in that friction zone. I'm keeping that clutch in the friction zone all the way through the U-turn. Then I'm using the rear brake head and eyes, and counterweighting to help get the motorcycle through the U-turn. So practice that next time you go out. Instead of squeezing the clutch all the way in, bring that clutch in when you're shifting gears far enough in to separate the clutch plates. You'll find that the bike shifts a little bit smoother and you'll find much smoother release of the clutch as you get into the higher gear and you're heading back down the road.